Hello, Assalamualaikum. I'm Muhammad Zafar. Uh, currently, I'm doing law at Zabis. So recently, I've started doing an internship with Quoting the Law, which is a renowned organization for the legal news and analysis portal. So I started writing an article on undue influence in elections. So now, in basic in basic layman's terminology, undue influence is basically the prevention of free exercise of the electoral rights of any voter, which means that if a person does not have the freedom to go to the poll without any fear or intimidation. I will give some basic examples. For example, if a person is not giving a vote due by force, by duress, which is pressure, furthermore, if through fraud, is not able to vote. Next, through inflicting an injury upon that person for not giving the vote. Furthermore, if that person is remarked as an object of divine displeasure, for example, give an example for this is that a Malvi states a fatwa that if you vote for a particular candidate, it will be a sin. This is one of the examples of divine displeasure. Lastly, one of the most, uh, it is the constitutional and fundamental right of a woman, of a woman to go and vote. However, in if a person prevents a woman to vote, it he is in the grasp of undue undue influence. Thank you for your time.